What's good, bit rushers? It's Kyler, and today I'm going to show you how to get Unicrypt. Unicrypt is the newest um, coin that's pumping this month. Honestly, wish I'd got into this one a little bit sooner in the month because it's already running. However, I still think there's gains to be made on this coin. Definitely not financial advice, but do your due diligence and your own research. And if you think this one's going to be good, I'll teach you how to get it. Before that, just a couple quick announcements. Please follow me at BitRush9000 on Twitter. You can chat with me and join my Telegram group. Also at BitRush9000, link in the description. And finally, I'm giving away some Ethereum when I hit 1,000 subs on the channel. So please sub to the channel, like the video if you thought the content was good, and leave your Ethereum address in the comments for a chance to win. Alright, let's get into it. Okay, let's start at CoinGecko, and let's just type this in real quick. So it's already number 322 on CoinGecko, which is pretty good for a coin that came out earlier this month. And you can see it's already pumping, so let's just go as far back as we can. Started out sub a penny. Looks like right around the 30th it started to pump up, and now we're currently sitting around 7 cents, 7.5 cents, so... You know, already had some big moves. Um, this one is so early, though, that it's hard to say. Like, normally I, I probably wouldn't get into a coin that pumped this hard. I'd wait for a little bit of a pullback. However, with this one, because it's brand new, it may just keep going up. You never really know. So, like I said, do your due diligence. Um, don't invest more than you can afford to lose, obviously. So, let's just go over what is Unicrypt. So, um, Unicrypt is actually a coin that's been developed by the Ethereum and Uniswap communities. It's basically a coin that they're trying to use to power the community. And they're trying to make Uniswap better and more secure and safer, add more dApps, a uh, bunch of stuff like that. So it's coming from the same guys as Uniswap and Ethereum, same guys working on those protocols and things. And really, they're trying to make it so it's harder to get scammed, right? They're trying to have a coin um, that powers things, and then they're trying to verify. So they have this Uniswap browser right here. So you, so you can see the trust, and they verify the liquidity and the contracts. So some of these um, coins on Uniswap, people would just go on there and add a coin. You see now there's this big token safety alert. Because anyone can add a token. I can make a token today and name it Unicrypt UNC, put it on Uniswap and it won't be the real one and I can get a bunch of people to buy it who aren't, you know, um, haven't done their due diligence and aren't experienced with cryptocurrency are just going to click on it and do it. So that's why Unicrypt has kind of created this browser for one. Um, they also have a bunch of other stuff they're trying to do, like they're going to have staking. Let me see, where's their roadmap? All right. Okay, so they're going to have a bunch of DApp development, uh, trading competitions, they're going to have liquidity providing um, programs for Uniswap, and also multi-asset staking. So pretty cool. Um, seems like a good coin, like I said, and it's tied in with Ethereum and Uniswap. Uniswap is basically the biggest um, swapping dex, I guess you'd call it. It's not an exchange because you're not really buying the coins, you're swapping them. But it's the biggest one out there for Ethereum and ERC-20 tokens. So to have a coin that then runs on that and powers different things um, built on that platform, you know, it seems like it's going to be a really good coin. And again, it just came out, like literally at the beginning of the month. Um, everyone's been talking about this one on Twitter. A bunch of YouTubers are pumping this. So, you know, for me, I, I try to stay away from... Um, you know, coins that are just going to be pump and dump, unless I think there's some money to be made on them along the way. And this one I think is going to be a legit project, okay? Um, you know, only time will tell, but with the team that they have, the developers and things like that, it's most likely that this is going to be around for a little while and it's going to be a good coin, most likely continue to move up because of the popularity of Uniswap. Um, but that's basically it, guys. That, that's why I'm trying. That's why I'm interested in getting this coin. Okay, so let's see how to get it. So we're gonna come to Uniswap, and I'm just gonna show you this full process. Just because sometimes people get confused. So if you start at Uniswap.info/home, you're gonna type in 
uni and right there it will come up unicrypt unc okay and from here we want to pick the pair that we want to trade so i want to trade on ethereum so it's going to be my eth unc pair and i'm just going to click trade right here okay and that will bring me back um what didn't bring me to the pair if i'd clicked on the pair it would have brought me to that last page all right so again they're giving you warnings they're saying make sure you know what contract this is so you can click up view on etherscan and I can open it up and I can see the contract and I can see it is the right one. You know, crypt.network. Um, you can actually come into the contract. Where is it? Read contract. No, hang on. You're supposed to be able to see the contract here. I'm not sure where that is. Maybe info. Oh, no, I got to click the actual contract. Okay, sorry, I guess so. Right here, if you click the actual contract, there you go. Now I can see the contract. Okay. So Unicrypt, yep. Unless someone copied it. The thing is, you never know. I mean, you really never know because they could have just copied the whole entire contract. But um, the easiest way to check it, I guess, would be just to come here. Like if I go to home, I think there was a trade. Yeah, trade on Uniswap. So if you go there, their link is going to be the right one, right? All right. So showed you a couple different ways to get to the trading now we're at the trading portion and we are going to trade ethereum for um, unc you're going to need metamask or another wallet if you don't have metamask or you don't know how to use metamask i have another video that i will link in the description that will teach you how to use metamask and set it up if you have metamask but your wallet isn't synced you're just going to need to click right here and um, what would show up for you is something like this with the wallet connect coinbase formatic portis or metamask if you have metamask and you're logged in just click on it and it will sync if you're not logged in you will need to log into metamask okay so brings us to here and now we want to choose the amount all right so let's just check my ethereum stash here i'm not sure where i'm at i got about 26 dollars worth um 6802 i'm actually gonna put all that in there so I think I'm gonna just max this guy out so to do that I'm gonna click max I usually put about $25 worth in each coin however um, you know the extra little bits not gonna be that big a deal that 1% that one uh, one dollar so I'm gonna end up with approximately 287 coins okay and, and the minimum received will be 284 this is always good to look at and you have your price impact so especially when you're dealing with these low coins if you're gonna make a large purchase a large swap you want to look at the price impact if your price impact is too large you want to make a smaller transfer so if you're trying to transfer several thousand dollars worth of ethereum into unc you'd want to do it in chunks of probably two or three hundred dollars so that it's not affecting the price okay so just as an example let me just delete this let's just say i was trading five ethereum my price impact is going to be 90 right so i want to get for uh 24,000, but i'm only looking at getting or 24,400, and i'm only looking at getting 24,200. so there's a 200 price impact of that okay so just keep that in mind when you're when you're doing this guys i, I don't want anyone to get burned or lose money on the actual swap itself with these low cap coins um, you need to be weary and make sure that you're not changing the price with your transaction okay so once we're here and you have all that filled out you can also change the slippage right if for whatever reason your slippage wasn't set right you can change the slippage to one percent and then just a simple swap actually you know what I'm gonna need to um, leave a little bit here because um, I'm gonna to need to pay the fee. So I'm gonna go just 0.5. Oh, five, five. How about that? There we go. All right, so that leaves me a little bit of Ethereum to pay my gas fee. We close this and now we can view on Etherscan. I can 
be your transaction, so it's approximately 35 seconds. Okay, so what we need to do now, though, is get this coin into our wallet. So if we come to our MetaMask wallet, we can see assets. It's not there. I have Ethereum, Ring, Moon, and Ghost, so I want to add a token. And then we're going to come up here to Uniswap. So if we go to the coin on Uniswap, I don't know why this is giving me trouble. The way I like to get this address, guys, is right from Uniswap, because you can copy and paste it out of the browser. So come to the coin. Where you're at the coin, in the browser, it says uniswap.info slash token slash 0x, and that 0x starts the ethereum address so we're going to just copy that metamask assets down at the bottom add token custom token we're going to paste in our ethereum contract address it already fills in the rest token symbol unc decimals is 18 okay so next and it's going to show you i have a balance of zero right now because that transfer has not completed so we're just going to click add tokens and i now have unc uh, in my wallet okay so we're still waiting on that transfer okay guys the transaction is complete we can now check in our wallet and there it is 272 UNC okay let's come back over to Unicrypt and connect wallet metamask choose the wallet you want there we go so I'm now in um, you can see I have 273 UNC and 0.01 ETH um, I am a rank sea cucumber so I didn't realize they're giving you ranks and stuff. It's going to be like a gamification. I think they're going to have some um, like asset, digital assets, uh, NFCs that you'll be able to use and trade. So a bunch of cool stuff coming with this, guys. Um, you know, make sure you do your research on this one. I don't want to try to pump this too hard, but I definitely think it's going to be a big coin and still fairly early to get in. With that said. Don't, don't invest more than you can afford to lose. Hope you enjoyed the content, guys. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Also, share with any friends or family you think may also like this video. And as always, sub to the channel. Leave your Ethereum address in the comments for your chance to win when I hit 1,000 subs. Happy mining. Let's get that coin.